Hey guys, what's up? It's Saturday. Woohoo! Well, Amber's at work. I'm out in the garage working. So, I had some epoxy primer left. Um, this gun <laughs> is history. I had sprayed some high build primer out of it, and the guy at the paint store said, You don't need a reducer with that, just the activator. Well, guess what? That stuff was so thick, I should have known better being a paint student, but I used it anyway. I tried, and it clogged up my gun. I think that gun's history. I got an 80 PSI and could not get it to spray out, which ooh, is pretty high, and that's not good. So, Anyway, so that's what we're doing today. Um, I have sanded, bondoed, or grinded down, bondoed the uh, harness bar, and this is we're just going to spray some epoxy over it, just to protect it. Some of my welds broke. One of my webbing broke. i got to take it back to my friend to redo. Yeah, I should have had him do it before I primed it. But you know what? It's sitting here bare metal. And I can't let it sit here like that anymore. Good rest. So, anyway, that's what we're doing today. The epoxy should protect it. Um, some of this is kind of ugly looking still. I'm still kind of working on it. But I wanted to get something on the bare metal so that it doesn't rust on me. But it's looking pretty good. So anyway, there's my beauty sitting in the driveway. Yeah, she can't be in here while I'm painting. I like the front bumper. Amber busted her butt yesterday working on it. Um, started putting some Bondo over the fiberglass side now. She's still shaping and bondoing this side. Um, it gets a lot of cracks in it when you just put the bondo right over the foam. So eventually you've got to put fiberglass on it. And then you can shape it some more. I'm trying to show you guys the car here. It's pretty bright out here. It's very hot outside today. Um, the back bumper I need Amber to help me with. I put some more bondo on it. Um, biggest problem with the back bumper, I can't get any of the bolt holes to match at all. Um, I need to try up under here. But see this? This is how it fits. So this much will stick out here, which is fine. Um, I can mold that in, like I said. But this side is a real problem, guys. Look how much of this sticks out over here. And I hope you guys can see this. Sometimes I have trouble doing my own camera work. Um, it wraps around under there fine, and the little, this thing, whoops, sorry guys, um, this thing right here goes underneath there pretty tightly, so I can bolt it there, but, so I was thinking, just measure how much extra I got here and mold it in, I'll have to do the same thing over there, I'm going to have a problem when it comes to my uh, gas tank though, I'm wanting to redo the gas tank, so. We'll, we'll figure out how we can redo it soon, hopefully. Um, I'm ready to take some cardboard and start doing a template of the fender flares. Because what I could do is just mold the back bumper into the fender flares I'm going to do. So, no, I haven't got out here to doing more body work on the car. Um, I'm just working on the harness bar for now. When I get that done, I'm going to work on my panels, my back seat panels, a little bit more because they're not quite done, guys. 